This is the Bobtot ET310C. Finally, a Bluetooth speaker that fixes my biggest pet peeve. Look at you, Bobtot, sporting those large, clearly labeled single purpose buttons. Mostly single purpose. I say mostly because the long press functionality is reserved for lesser used functions, like clearing out all the known Bluetooth devices, or entering TWS mode, or changing the volume of your karaoke microphone. The ET310C is a 60 watt system, and if you look closely through the speaker grill, it appears that there are dual three and a half inch full range drivers up front flanked by tweeters. Although these tweeters aren't really there. <laughs> there's, there, I don't know if they're decoration or vents or what, but there are, no, there are no speakers up here. But they do have two passive radiators in the side to help with the bass. I don't see this very often, but the equalizer button allows you to choose between two modes, indoor or outdoor. What might that be? Well, that's a good question. Indoor mode is for more bass and outdoor mode is for more treble. Why do they call it that? I don't know. Is there a way to turn it off? No, you must choose between one or the other. Whenever I see one of these rubber plugs on the back of a Bluetooth speaker, I wonder if it is waterproof. And in this case, it is not. This is IPX6 water resistant, which means you can splash it, you could leave it out in a light rain, but don't immerse the speaker in water. And it's best just not to get it wet at all. But if you do, it'll probably be okay. Behind this rubber plug, we have all kinds of ports, a TF card slot, a wired microphone port, USB-C charging port, a U-Drive slot, and a three and a half millimeter auxiliary input port. If you want, you can use this speaker as a power bank and use the USB port to charge your devices. If you look at the box, it is labeled outdoor party speaker. When I hear party speaker, I assume there is an RGB lighting system. And on this speaker, there is not. However, if you look at this side of the box, it just says TWS portable speaker. And if you look at this side of the box, it says portable wireless speaker. So maybe they just weren't all that serious about the party mode. The Bobtot ET310C is priced above entry level, but still very reasonable. And I think it performs well at that level. You can listen to any kind of music, but if you are listening to something with very, very deep bass, it'll probably top out at about 60% volume before you start getting distortion. And if you are listening to regular music, I would say you can bring it up to about 75% volume and enjoy the experience. So yes, it's 60 watts, but they're not 60 usable watts. I would put it more like 40 usable watts. I did run into an issue when I was attempting to test the karaoke features of this speaker. I use wireless microphones and the receivers are just too large to make a solid connection to this port. So plan on using wired microphones and if possible, find some that have volume adjustments on the microphone itself because I just think messing around with the long press is just, it would be irritating. It takes about three hours to fully charge the Bobtot ET310C, and they say you can get up to 25 hours of playback on this device, depending upon volume level. If you avoid speaker distortion, you will be keeping the speaker at 60%, 70% volume, and then you can probably expect some very decent battery life. I should probably mention the solid construction of this speaker. It's all just hard plastic. I don't see anything that could really break on it. You might be able to get a dent in the metal speaker grill and you wanna be careful around these passive radiators. I, if You just don't wanna push them in or anything. Also, these rings up here are for the included uh, strap. You just kind of snap it in place. There's one on both sides. And then you've got a shoulder strap, so that's nice. I also like this really grippy handle. Uh, there's plenty of space, no matter how big your hand is, it's gonna fit well in here. So all in all, very well constructed. How do I rate the Bobtot ET310C? 
This is a very competitive speaker in the mid-range product level. It has these awesome controls, solid construction. The sound is good. I love the connectivity options with the TF card slot, the three and a half millimeter auxiliary input, microphone for karaoke, U drive port, and it's a power bank too. It's a, in this price category, it's an easy decision. Five out of five stars. Thanks for stopping by.